Hi, in this quick video I will tell you about the anatomy of a neuron. Our brain contains around 100 billion neurons, intricately interconnected little cells that produce our consciousness which makes them awesome. Neuron consists of cell body with nucleus, dendrites. Dendrites are extensions of a neuron through which it receives electrical signals from other cells. Axon. Axon is like a long wire through which neurons send signals to other neurons. Axon is covered with myelin sheath separated by nodes of Ranvir. And synapse. Synapse is a place where axon of one neuron connects to the dendrite of another. The first neuron is called presynaptic and the second is called postsynaptic. There is a narrow space between the two neurons and it is called the synaptic cleft. Neuron receives electrical signals from its dendrites. And if at the beginning of the axon, at the place called axon hillock, combined signal exceeds a certain threshold, neuron fires and signal is propagated along the axon. This signal is called action potential. Axon is covered with myelin sheath separated by gaps, which are called the nodes of Ranvir. Myelin sheath acts like insulator, helping to propagate the signal, and the nodes of Ranvir help to amplify it. At the end of the axon, signal reaches the axon terminal. This terminal contains vesicles filled with neurotransmitters. When signal reaches them, they merge with the cell membrane and release neurotransmitters to the synaptic cleft. Neurotransmitters pass through the synaptic cleft and bind to the receptors, located on the dendrite of the postsynaptic cell. And when that happens, postsynaptic neuron finally receives a signal. Signals can be excitatory or inhibitory. Excitatory signals make neuron more likely to fire, inhibitory signals make it less likely to fire. And then, the postsynaptic neuron combines all the signals received from its dendrites and the process repeats all over again. Well, I hope this was useful to you. See you next time.